coding for me, it's a way to put my ideas down in the computer and it's also a hobby because you can get really into it once you've started making your project. Um, I think that coding for me is an experience and opportunity that has changed how I think about um, computers and coding. I think for me it's, I find it important because if you think about the world we live in, so much of it is dominated by computers and technology, so I think we, should, we ought to have at least a basic understanding of that. For me, coding is like a whole new language that has allowed me to do so much more, for example, where I am now, and everything that I've done is thanks to coding. Coding for me is a, it's a way of helping students get the skills they need for life. It's not just about them going into their rooms and doing all the coding and keeping to themselves. They actually speak to other students and find out where their problems are coming from and work together as a team. Uh, there's collaboration, uh, obviously, that's a really good one. And for example, my students have come here and they're actually approaching other students in their classroom to test their game. So it, it's not just about being all, to, all together at the coding is actually a much bigger thing than w any of us can in, think about. <laughs> coding for us it's a way to express our feelings in a program. Through, creating, uh, through the creation of something new um, we, uh, we also know that behind every um, single um, device there is code and programming behind so we, uh, after reflecting on that, we thought that code, uh, code is the um, uh, p profession of the future, let's say. It's a really big part for developing the 21st century skills that I think that, the most, uh, that, uh, that they are the most useful skills that someone can get in the 21st century. Coding for me is uh, fun and putting my thoughts into computer so everybody can see what I think. We enjoyed playing the Kodo with Kodo Game Lab. It was uh, interesting and uh, it had fun in it with coding. Sometimes coding is like frustrating writing codes, but it has like pictures and it's fun. Kodo is very simple and even though it's uh, really, really simple, it can do really advanced stuff. I think of coding as being like um, pl playing chess. With chess there's a small number of rules, yet it can be really complex and really difficult. Uh, with coding, small number of rules, but actually you can make the world, you can build things and make really interesting things. Coding is uh, a real important uh, skill that kids must uh, must uh, be uh, aware of. Uh, they must know the basics of uh, of coding, and I believe that Kodu for these kids, for six years old and seven years old, can be a great tool to introduce them to coding. Uh, even if they are not going to work with coding, uh, since uh, coding is present all over the world, all over the the, the different uh, professions uh, I think they must if they want to have an opportunity in the future they know coding it's it's very important. Coding for me is telling the computer to do the things you want it to do. Starting off with a blank page writing off and making a product out of it. Coding is a language and it is also a tool but it really is nothing more than that. Uh, what matters to me is what you do with the tool, what you build with the tool, what you create with the tool. That can be almost anything, digital art, games, music, concepts of art we never seen before. So coding is the tool to do that. Well, coding is a way of uh, teaching to do other things because I think it's very important in this environment, in this uh, a culture of Belgium and everywhere to learn a lot of things like critical thinking, uh, like collaboration and all that things and think Kodo is a way to uh, practice all the, those things. That Young people should think about coding because it, it gives them much more opportunity in life. So if, if, they, if they know about coding early on, they can, they can, anything they choose to do in life, it'll be very useful to them because virtually everything now needs some code even your TV, anything you can think of, anything you want to operate needs, needs a bit of line of, of code there. So if young kids 
know what's going on, know how the world works, then they have the knowledge, and knowledge is power. So their parents should support them, they should want that knowledge, and they will be very strong, and, and Europe will be very strong. I really feel it's important for, for young kids now to start learning how to code. I mean, the economy of the 21st century will be a digital economy. They will have to cope with a lot more data than, uh, than let's say, the older people uh, used to do in their younger days. So I think it's really important that they also get the digital skills that they need to function in a 21st century society. So through the schools, through the companies, through playing around, I think it's important that they, they acquire these skills. It's clearly the, uh, the future for young people in Europe to get more and more involved in computer science and coding in particular. Uh, create uh, um, new ways to push for what you care for. So uh, we really need to stress these aspects uh, to make the people understand that coding is not only uh, for geeks. Coding is, is a language that we use to, to teach um, uh, children about, or teach anybody about um, speaking to computers. But what's really important is the thinking that generates that code, the thinking behind the language. Um, so it, it's more about computational thinking, and code is the way that we communicate that, that com computational thinking. Coding for me is something fun. For me too. <laughs> and for me too.